On Saturday, about midnight, Christian and Hopeful began to pray, and they continued in prayer until almost the break of day. A little before dawn, good Christian, as one half amazed, broke out into this passionate exclamation, What a fool I have been to lie in a stinking dungeon like this, when I could just as well walk free. I have a key in my pocket, next to my heart, called Promise, that will, I am sure, open any lock in Doubting Castle. That is good news, good brother. Pluck it from your pocket and try it. So Christian pulled the key from his chest pocket and fit it into the lock on the dungeon door. As he turned the key, the bolt released, and the door flew open with ease. Christian and Hopeful both fled the dark cell. Then he went to the outward door that led into the castle yard. He tried his key, and it opened that door also. From there he made haste to the outer iron gate, for he knew he must open that gate to escape. But he struggled with that lock, for it was desperately hard. But finally the key opened it. They thrust the gate open to make their escape. But as it opened, the gate made such a creaking noise that it awoke giant despair. He hastily left his bed and pursued his prisoners. But he felt paralysis overcoming his limbs, for one of his fits came over him again and made it impossible for him to go after them. So Christian and Hopeful hurried on until they came to the king's highway. Once again they were safe, because they were out of the giant's jurisdiction. Now when they had crossed over the stile, they began to consider what they could do at that location to prevent pilgrims coming after them from being deceived and falling into the hands of giant despair. They agreed between themselves to erect a pillar with a clear message engraved on its side, saying, over this dial is the way to Doubting Castle, which is kept by giant despair, who despises the king of the celestial country and seeks to destroy his holy pilgrims. As a result, many who have followed after them have read what was written and escaped the danger. Once they finished this project, they sang the following song. Out of the way we went, and then we found what it meant to tread upon forbidden ground, and let those who come after have a care, lest heedlessness makes them as we to fare, lest they for trespassing his prisoners are, whose castles doubting, and whose name despair.